Hello and welcome to another episode of our Chelsea Player Career Mode series. So before we get into a new season, this is how the last one finished. Man City finished top with 102 points and there we are in fourth with 91 points. So as we are scrolling down the league, you can see where the teams did finish. Before we do get into the relegation zone where Stoke finished rock bottom on five points. Also going down was West Ham and Southampton. Uh, Liverpool won the Carabao Cup with a 1-0 win over us. Man City beat Spurs 3-1 in the FA Cup. AC Milan beat Leipzig 2-1 in the Europa League and Barcelona beat us 1-0 in the Champions League. We had an offer from Napoli which we rejected and then we got onto our first training session with a bit of shooting, a bit of free kick. We had a lob pass as well, this was a great chance from Jovic. We done round the clock just to get the pace up and then a brilliant tackle in the defending by Flash. So we got all A's, we are currently on 87 rating. Uh, when we get into our first game then, obviously the shed end as you can see it there, beautiful sight. The first game at Stamford Bridge, the first game of the season as well. And this is how we line up our 4-3-3. Uh, a completely new back four as well from how we started the series. So this is how they line up with a 4-5-1 formation. So they do get the first chance of the game. A decent header on the 28th minute. We get a chance with Jorginho, but just goes wide. And then Flash with his left foot. And look at his celebration. It's embarrassing and that's why he gets brought off, I think. So Jovic replaces us on the 60th, 61st minute, whatever you want to say. They do get close with this header and you can see how close it is from this angle. Very unlucky, but that is how the game did finish. A 1-0 win for Chelsea, our first game of the season. So it's great to get that start and flash. Yeah, you deserve to raise your hands, mate. You are the match winner with his 61st minute goal. Uh, we finished with a match rating of 8.2, so we weren't too bad, but disappointing to get brought off. Our next game is a game against Manchester United, so... A difficult team to face in our second game in the episode. They finished fifth last season. They've made a couple of noticeable signings. The first one being the lit centre half who partners Maguire. We got off to a great start though. In the 18th minute, Flash does all his own work. He gets onto his right foot and smashes it into the back of the net. And it's poor defending by United, to be fair. No one really closes him down. We get a great chance as well. Our right back comes out of nowhere and smashes the side net in though. And we get brought off in the 62nd minute for Jovic. It's getting a regular thing, and it was last season. Uh, we do turn into Barcelona, though, in the 70th minute. It takes a couple of minutes to get there, but we have to speed up the play. We do square it inside to Bakayoko, and look at that miss. It's so poor. It would have been goal of the season already. What a build-up play that was, but that is how it finished. A 1-0 win over Manchester United. And it, to be fair, it was a great goal from Flash. And it would have been an even better goal with Bakayoko. But unfortunately, he just sliced it wide. We finished with a match rating of 7.5. Uh, we do some more training. And we do get to rating 88. So the only thing going up there was dribbling. We are up to 94 dribbling now. Our next game, again at home, was a tough one. We played the other side of Manchester. Game against Manchester City. The team who won the league last season. And I'm sure they'll be up there this season. So we both have the same formation, a 4-3-3. So it's going to be a tough game. And I'm very disappointed by the referee in this. It should have been a red card. Let me know what you guys think. You'll see another replay of it now. You'll see one after this as well. And he's the last man. That's the thing. He's the last man. He should be sent off. I did have to just check it because I weren't sure if he was in the box or not. And he is outside the box when he does commit the foul. So Flash takes a free kick and I wish he never, it was so poor. Edison pulls off this great save as well, but they do go ahead with Rodri. Oh, well, Rodrigo, the back of his shirt saves, but he smashes it into the back of the net and sends Man City 1 0 up. But we do level the tie. Bakayoko squares it to Mason Mount, and it's a great build up play. And to be fair, it was harder to miss, wasn't it? But thankfully, he's there anyway to put the ball into the back of the net. They almost get a goal with Bernardo, but Bakayoko gets a chance for us as well. And Edison pulls off a great save. And yeah, we get brought off again. In the same time as well, very similar times. It's very poor, but we do score even without us not on the pitch. Mason Mount puts us 2-1 up and it's a great build-up play as well. They get a great chance with De Bruyne near the death and he should be finishing there. And that is how it finished. So a 2-1 win over the title winners from last season. So two goals coming from Mason Mount. Surely he did get man of the match and we finish on a disappointing match rating of 7 we then have to simulate the game against Liverpool, a game I would have loved to have played against. Uh, but Jovic takes our place and we, have, we end up losing 3-0. So we then get into our final game of the episode. Another game at Stamford Bridge and it's another London derby. So we've played two teams from London and two teams from Manchester. So Arsenal are the opponents in our final game of the episode. We always stay with the same formation and they line up with a like a 4-2-3-1. And to be honest, it's not the best of games. Chances were very poor. That's one of the best chances we've had, and it just shows. That was a great tackle, though, by one of our defenders in the box. We then get a chance with Flash, and his chance is blocked. 
We get brought off again in the 58th minute for Jovic. Uh, we do get a chance over Pulisic, but he smashes it just wide in the side netting. So the man who replaces us, Jovic, does get a chance, but our best chance probably comes from Loftus cheek, but forces to keep it into a save. So that is the end of the game. It's very poor. A 0 0 draw against Arsenal. Stalemate. Disappointing derby. So that is all the games today. Only league games. Uh, so next episode will be mainly cups. We might even throw a league game or two in there. So we finished the episode off in third with 42 points. Hot on the heels of Spurs and also Liverpool. It only takes one win, but Liverpool have got better goal difference. Uh, so as we're scrolling down the league, you can see some of the teams, how they are coming in after 17 games played. With Brentford rock bottom, only scoring six goals, conceded 46, only one point, very disappointing. So this is how the Champions League table did finish. We finished in second with 13 points, just one point beyond Atletico Madrid who finished top. Uh, so we do get drawn against Barcelona in the round of 16, so it's going to be a very tough game. Uh, hard opponents in that round. Uh, FA Cup round isn't drawn yet, still round two, and the quarter-final draw in the Carabao Cup has gave us a difficult one against Liverpool. So that will be included in the next episode, guys, and we probably will even start off with that game. So I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll catch you next episode, guys. Take care, and I'll see you soon.